Zelda Tears of the Kingdom has so many vehicles you can check out and unlock. However, so many of these vehicles are completely useless. You will never use half of these. Some of them are pretty cool ideas and whatnot, but you will be able to go around collecting them. I mean, bomb bouquet, very cool ideas. But there is one vehicle that you can make right now. You can save it to your favorites and you're gonna be able to just use it anytime you ever need any transport. And the good news is it's cheap on battery. So let's show you guys exactly what that is. So let's whip out our items here. We are going to order them via the Zonai devices and all you're gonna need for this is two fans and a steering stick. All right, and if you guys need more fans and steering sticks, you can totally duplicate them. Let me show you exactly how to do that before we get building. It's super easy. Just find a wall or any enclosed space and stand a little tiny distance away from that wall. And I think that's okay here. And we're gonna go into our inventory for the Zonai devices. We're going to, here's rockets at 992, which is perfect. We're gonna take out eight of those devices. We're gonna hit B and Y at the same time. And as you can see, it went back up to 992 and we have now 999. The items I was supposed to take out filled the gap as well as the items that I took out being replenished and put back into my bag anyway. So we basically got double of whatever I took out. You will absolutely be able to do that to fill up anything you need. All right, so now for the building part. With this vehicle, you're never gonna need any other vehicle ever again. And this is the fastest way to get around in the air and just get anywhere you want. You have complete control. First thing you wanna do is put a fan face down on the ground. Next up, we're gonna pick up the steering stick and we're gonna hold R and press down. Well, it depends on what angle it's facing you, but you want it to look like this, all right? Put it at this angle right here, 45 degree or whatever, with the steering stick part facing upwards like this. Now you're gonna to wanna to attach it to the edge, the very edge of the fan, right in the center, so it looks like that, okay? Not on the upper part here. You wanted to make sure it's right on the edge of the lower part of the fan, the bulky part, and it should look like this, facing upwards as well. Next up, we're gonna get the second fan. Also, having started it placed down, we're gonna attach the edge of that to our steering stick. As best we can, make sure it's linear, like this. Is that good? That is perfect. So now that's it, that's it. Now we can actually get on this. You can save this to your favorites. And this bike, this hover bike, you have complete control over. You don't, you do not have to go up. You can go down. You can go downwards, which is really important. And you can go upwards, which is really important to be able to have that kind of control. Because a lot of the times when you're making these items, you're going to be uh, only able to go either, either go up or forward or whatever, not have the options of going up and down. And yes, you can do with this with this, and it's super fast as well. You also got the speed. This is gonna be a lot faster than most of the items you can make yourselves, uh, just without having seen this guide. And the best part of this entirely is that it only requires three items. It's so efficient on your battery. As you can see, my blue battery being depleted here. I still got green underneath it. <laughs> So, I mean, I can write this forever. I mean, I, sadly, my battery is so much battery that I actually can't even get the full use out of the vehicle that I'm using because the vehicle's parts themselves will disappear way before my battery disappears. I can only get through a quarter of my battery here, uh, which is sad. It's kind of sad that I can do that. But you can see my mobility here. I've gone up, up, up. I've gone down, down, down. I can go anywhere I want. And it's just so powerful, this vehicle. You'll never need anything else. Absolutely save this to your favorites, 100%. So we're kind of coming to the half of my battery here after this one. And sadly, that means this vehicle is going to start disappearing at that point. But underneath the blue, you can still see I have full green. I don't know why this game has so much battery. Honestly, I don't, because you cannot use this much battery. If you guys are interested in checking out how to get all this battery, uh, I will show you guys the video at the end of this one. It's so easy. So there we go. That's half my, that's, sorry, that's a quarter of my battery gone. And actually, luckily, we are still riding this. So that's pretty cool. So I guess it varies b between vehicles. But man, we have the most mobility you'll ever have in the game with this. Let's just go up to the top of Temple of Time. I actually just want to show you guys the world here. Uh, up here is a worthy person here. There's a little computer, little droid. You can talk to that person to get the Zonai fabric. All right, talk to them to get the Zonai fabric for your glider, which is this one right here. That's a pretty cool one too. So if you like that, it's got like a gold shimmer on the white. It's really nice. But that's the vehicle, folks. 
I mean, you you can see how just wow, oh my god, that's everything you need to know. Hopefully, this guide will help you just get around, especially in the depths, the most mind-numbing place to try and explore without a good vehicle. It's super important. But this is going to allow you to go from island to island very easily as well. And as you can see, it actually lasted way longer than I expected for my battery. I don't know why some vehicles last very short time, some last very long time. I think it might depend on how many devices you're using and all that stuff. But uh, if you guys are interested in getting more battery you can check out that as well if you guys are interested in getting a better guide on the duplications for all your zonai devices check out that video right there hopefully this video was useful do subscribe if you're new and you did find it useful because we pop out these videos all day long i'll see you guys around the next one till then bye